Hey. Okay. So this isn't too hot. I'm making honey, um, honey spiced, honey sliced. Let me check what it is. I can't remember. Honey orange slices is the official recipe. That's beautiful. So, and that is an all spice and there's some cloves right there at the top. Let me show you the process from the beginning to the end for one of these. So I'm using tongs to get in here. I get these and I want them to lay pretty in the jar. So these can be used for tea or for toppings for dessert or a cocktail. I'm using a safe canning recipe from Balm. And this will be water bath canned because it's fruit. It doesn't have to be pressure canned. It just smells so good. I'm going to throw a couple of cloves in there. When I get done, if there's any of the leftover honey juice, orange juice in here, I'll save that. And I can use that in place of just regular honey and recipes. I'll probably keep it in the fridge since it has orange juice in it too. But just something fun new to try. I've never done this before. I've canned before, but I've never canned oranges. So I'm going to just finish this off here. This tool here is called a debubbler, de bubbler. So you push it down and get all the air bubbles out of it. And I use local raw honey, but then you heat it so it actually like some of the properties in it that makes it so wonderful for like natural healing kind of stuff. Um, you lose them when it's heated, but you still get all that amazing honey flavor. So these are like packed in honey. Just making sure it's at the right headspace. And then you take a cloth dipped in vinegar and you wipe the edge. And I'm going to take my lid come on top. And I'm going to finger tight. This is funny. In the, um, <laughs> one of the Amazon things, the girl, the model or whatever is holding this upside down in the Amazon, um, storefront and it cracks me up every time I see it. But the correct way is this end, not the other end like the picture shows. There we go. In here in the jar, I already have about half of them filled. And I'll wash my hands. It needs to go in this, um, in the hot water to actually seal. So I just closed it. Um, that doesn't mean that it's sealed. And then to actually preserve it, it needs to go into the canner. Um, this is a water bath canner. Um, and it needs to boil for a certain amount of time um, to make it shelf stable. All right, well, um, yeah, this is me canning the orange slices. I just was walking through the process real quick and thought I would just show you from start to finish what it looked like actually putting it in a jar.